we definitely just we got really down and I knew that we were going to come back because we're just better than that and the fact that we were down to me really was surprising it just I think it, I kind of like came in into shock in the beginning I was like okay what's going on but like shots just weren't falling and we weren't necessarily playing as a team but we figured it out for a little while and then at the end we just couldn't finish because we went back to not playing as a team. Definitely just come out more prepared. I think that like our energy was kind of there today, but not like it should have been. It's very hard to come back from a deficit like that. Eastern Washington did a good job knocking some shots down from deep early. They uh, they were 7 of 16 from the three point line for the game, which is exceptional shooting. Uh, and we did a poor job finding shooters. We, you know, we did a poor job finding shooters and they made us pay. Uh, I was proud of our effort for the way we fought back. Uh, we just couldn't couldn't finish and you know, made some questionable decisions with the basketball and, and uh, again fouled too many times down the stretch and uh, you know, hopefully we'll learn our lesson sooner than later. ourselves. If we play hard and we help ourselves, good things are going to happen. And even if we help ourselves and play with the energy level we need to have and we don't win, it's still going to be a good day because we'll have, we'll have gotten better. But we, we have to learn from our mistakes. And I, that was the, probably the most disappointing aspect of tonight's game. You, know, you have to give Eastern Washington credit because they played a nice basketball game. But we have to start learning from, from our mistakes, especially on the offensive end of the court. to lose like that though because you work so hard to come back so it's a tough loss and I wish that last shot would have went in but it's okay. Yeah.